And now all new at five, a family's plea for help finding the shooter who killed a father who was trying to protect his one-year-old baby. Darren Williams died less than two weeks ago. His baby spent days in the hospital being treated for his gunshot wound. CBS 4's Peter Dench is live tonight in Miami Gardens with what his family had to say. Peter. Ruta Bay, this is a close-knit family that is heartbroken. Darren Williams was an aspiring firefighter who was shot and killed on Monday night of last week outside the family home while holding his one-year-old son. Now, Miami Gardens police tell us there are no new leads in this case, which is why this family appeal is so important. Well, we stand here as a community and a family in pain. Um, we're asking for the help of the community. My cousin Darren, or his son didn't deserve this. LaTanya well, Brown's 27-year-old cousin, Darren Williams, was shot and killed while holding his one-year-old son, Darren, who was also wounded in the drive-by. With a child's grandmother and mother sobbing and dozens of loved ones at their side, Brown spoke out Darren. This was all due to the action of cowards. Darren was doing nothing wrong. He was defying the odds. He was defying the odds and fighting to become a great father. Williams have dreamed of becoming a firefighter and had graduated from the academy last year. He was only 27 years old. He had a lifetime ahead of him. He had dreams, he had aspirations. Police say dozens of rounds were fired at Williams outside the family home in Miami Gardens. This did not have to happen. And we cannot allow, we cannot allow this to happen. We cannot not allow for these cowards to walk free. The police chief, who is also a mother of three children, called for the community to help out. I'm so tired of seeing all these different families grieving about the same thing about losing their son and their daughter. Um, Darren was a special young man who was achieving, you know, goals that other people didn't achieve. And so he should have had the right to go on and, and, and grow and, and grow with his young son. Our family is in pain. This is pain that will remain with us for the rest of our lives. If you have any humanity, any empathy, please help us. Now, Miami Gardens police say they are looking for four males who are in a dark colored sedan with tinted windows and a paper tag. It could be either a Honda Accord or Civic. If you can help police, call them or Miami Day Crime Stoppers at 305 471 TIPS. There is a reward in this case of up to $13,000. We're live in Miami Gardens. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.